That's the elevator I took with Corel and Nikki. If we're lucky, maybe they're on their way down right now. When have we ever been lucky? Oh, it did seem unlikely. All I know is I am really starting to hate this elevator. I took this mission to get us out of jail! Not because I thought that you was... You know... You will grow into your parental role, Peter Quill! <laughs> Eventually! <laughs> Boom! Channel your newfound paternal energy, Peter Quill! I thought you... I kicked butt before and I'm kicking butt now! Nothing changes! Everyone okay? Anyone hurt? Rock a kick. Gonna start being all paternal now? We're fine, Peter. We know how to fight. I know. I, I just. We'll find them. Don't worry. You said Corral's office was up top somewhere? Yeah. Just need to make our way up. Next stop, Corral's office. Okay. Yeah, that's a lot. Oh. Everyone's got at least two abilities now. Apart from me, but come on, just admit it, Quill. You're freaking out right now. This whole deadbeat dad thing's got to be eating at you. Some need many years to fully comprehend their paternal responsibility. The prospect of maybe being a dad is a little scary. A little. Embrace the panic, Peter Quill. It is the essence of fatherhood. <laughs> Well, that don't look good. <laughs> there was a struggle here. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm reacting to? I am reacting in my own way. This doesn't look good, Peter. All we know is that there was a fight. We don't know who won. Pretty sure I know. So, where's this office, Quill? It's around here somewhere. Place wasn't this messed up last time. When in doubt, follow the stench of death. Drax, buddy! Smash it! My dude! Thanks, Shanks. I just realized something. And Nikki's a tech expert, knows her way around ships, fits into small spaces. Don't you dare finish that sentence. <laughs> and she seems to get along well with Peter. <laughs> Good luck replacing me with a dead kid. Jesus, replace me with a dead kid, you know. Goodness. Rocket is <laughs> so I have been up. thinking. It is customary on Katath to bathe new fathers in a river of blood. Lucky for Peter we're not on Katath. <laughs> Damn straight. Hello. Oh god. Corral? Nikki? Looks empty. Feels empty. Maybe they're hiding. Were well, there always strange writings on the wall? I'm gonna try and get in her computer. See if I can wipe my criminal history. Rocket! I'm kidding. I'm gonna access her logs. You wanna know what happened here or not? Fine. The rest of us will take a look around. Maybe they left a clue or something. The scribbles are Cree. This one says, Mother knows best. Alright, so about this Return, mother. Return. Hope. Promise. Nikki! Obvious signs of a struggle, Peter Quill. Yeah, this doesn't look good. <laughs> ah, appealing. <laughs> this must be Corel's first kid. I remember she talked about him a lot. He was on Hala, right? When the Shatari. Yeah. Her kid and her husband. Explains how <laughs> fearless she was during the war. She had nothing to lose. Man. Corel had a real artistic side to her. She was the only Cree I ever knew who painted and played music. I used to think it was a sign of weakness, but... No. It's a strength. Definitely a sign of strength. <laughs> Whoa. 
What is this? Some kind of a threat? The Cree Council demands proof of Nikki's heritage under the Cree purity laws. What Cree mm -hmm. purity laws? Corral never told you that either? The Cree are extremely strict about their bloodlines. Oh, this does not look good. For you? No, for Nikki. What are the chances the Cree are involved in any of this? The Council of Purity isn't cryptic. When they punish someone, they make sure everyone knows it. Corel and Nikki will be hanging from the wall. Oh. Cree Purity Laws. Jesus. The resemblance is uncanny. She doesn't look anything like me. She's blue. <laughs> Besides, why wouldn't Corel have just told me? Protect her daughter, Peter Quill. Copulating with you was a capital offense under the Cree Purity Laws. Oh, right. Oh, good. That. So when Corel said we shouldn't be doing this... He was being literal. <laughs> Interesting, I love how they're still law building for all this. I wonder if Nikki made this. I am Groot. Some kind of dye machine. Is it normal for Kree to dye their hair? Not unless they're hiding something. Ah, uh, I wonder if she's got naturally blonde hair. Like mine rather than her mum's. Nikki's ID. Something seems off, though. What do you mean, off? I don't know. Like it's been flagged or something. Not sure. Is the girl's date of birth on those documents? Does it match with the typical Cree gestation period? <laughs> I really wouldn't know. <laughs> okay, I'm in. But I got bad news, lover boy. What did you find? Come here and I'll show you. Hey, Quill, you interested in seeing this or not? So what am I looking at? Nothing. Huh? She's the captain. Captains keep logs. You keep logs? I I'm trying to tell you, they're gone. All of them. Almost like the world mind went out of its way to sever everything. Mm. Have you tried turning it off and on? What about <laughs> backups? Doesn't every Nova ship have a central hub or something? A Nexus mainframe, yeah. If there's ghosts anywhere in the system, that's where. I categorically refuse. Not literal ghost tracks. <laughs> He's talking about data. Right? Yes. But we'd have to access the Nexus directly. Means going to the bridge. We're not leaving until we find out what happened. Center of operations it is. To the bridge? According to the ship's map, the bridge should be right through here. Dog oh. report item. It's one of them priests down there, ain't it? Oh, no, 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 no. Boost, boost. Uh, nuts to this. I'm out of here. Stop. Uh, um, what the shit? No, oh, so that's not what it is. Dog report item. We are under attack. By a giant robot. Some weird freaks. This week against giant robot. Okay, yeah, definitely a dog report item. Oh no, just drugs. You just met with the wrong attacker. I'm not oh, shit, no. Focus, Peter! This thing's trying to kill us! That big robot is a serious problem! The contraption cannot predict our merciless unity! Hell, Rex! You struggle in vain! I find punching flesh much more stubborn! There we go, stun, stun, stun. Everyone's going big. I'm on it! There you go. Man, that giant robot can take a lot of pain! Things built tough! 
we need to really pile it on. It's gonna be something again. So are we thinking this thing is brainwashed people? I do not feel brainwashed right now. I feel shot at. Ooh. It's on. We've got to apply more pressure. Drax, kick their so butt. Make your down. piece. Cut the pieces. Ooh, 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 ooh. We must tell there the dog about the priest. Robot priest. Groot says the mutt's not answering. Keep trying. The rest of us can focus on figuring a way out. Really? Oh. This is the server room, right? And servers mean data? I can't just plug servers into my skull. I still need a central terminal. You said the bridge was on the other side of that corridor. That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. How am I supposed to know why the pooch ain't picking up? Keep trying. Perhaps we should have interrogated the robot priest. <laughs> okay, so according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the rodent? No! Oh, <laughs> All right, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. I have never understood how so much information is stored. Oh. What, <laughs> Basically don't understand. Couldn't boost away or anything. That was just like guaranteed death. That was less than ideal. Haven't died in combat yet though, so that's something. We must tell the dog about the priest. Robot priest. That'll do it. Well played, Peter Quill. How am I supposed to know why the pooch ain't picking up? Keep trying. Okay, so according to the map I saw, Nexus should be just above us. Uh, shall I throw the rodent? No! Come on! <laughs> All right, let's look around. Maybe we can find something. I'm gonna check this way again. But not get it educated. Huh. It's weird, right? How the world mind seems to have gone completely dark? Very weird. Perhaps it is rebooting. All the words you could have used there, Drax, that one actually wasn't too bad. Thank you. It was either that or reloading. Can this be moved? I've got to scan it first. I have never understood how so much information could be stored in such a magical way. There's an open panel up in the corner there. Pretty sure that's our exit. Perfect. So we oh, just shit. gotta jump across a few of these floating server things? Seems, uh, perfectly safe. They contain near the infinite it. stores Thanks of more. data. Pretty sure they can temporarily support our puny mortal frames. Well, can mine you anyway. Back? And yours too, I yes. Can maybe jump that. I wanna try and figure this out though, because how the hell am I shooting this from here? So, is this another one of Peter's leaders don't go first situations? Really seems like he should be going first. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, maybe. Just give me a sec. Perhaps we should have interrogated the. Is it on a cycle? Okay. Yeah. Next time we encounter a giant, deadly robot priest, we'll tie him up first and ask questions. That rope. Okay, here we go. No, no. Ooh. That was, that was, that was... Oh! 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 That was close. I don't know what I really I'm thinking it's this way. 
Dog report item. We have encountered a formidable new enemy, but still no sign of the ghosts. To think, all of this could have been avoided had the rodent not broken the glass. You're blaming him for that? <laughs> hey, Groot, any luck getting through to Cosmo yet? I am Groot. Nope, still nothing. Reception will probably be better once we're on the bridge. Oh, sick. Okay, this is it, the command center. Which I guess Look at makes this. that the next control terminal. Fingers crossed we find something useful. I'm thinking you should do the honors, Quill. That does not seem like you. He probably thinks the next is booby trapped. Ah, uh, that would explain it. Hey, I ain't the one that's eager to know what happened. Let Quill see for himself. Huh. I wonder. What are we waiting for, Peter? Yeah, yeah, just psyching myself up. On explosion, docking, hazardous materials. Okay. Believe in yourself. Find something? Just some personal logs. What do you think, Groot? He says it's the best. I do not understand. Why is Peter Quill not accessing the Nexus? Because he's scared of ghosts. Liar. <laughs> nice. That's <laughs> quite the mustache. Find zero, something. Zero, zero, one, so Corell's badge number is zero 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 one. How could she be the first one? The world mind reset all Nova IDs after the Galactic War. <laughs> Makes sense. A Carlos. Something. Dog report item. We have reached the command center, but Peter Quill refuses to access the Nexus. Hmm. I wonder what this does. Nothing useful is my guess. Nova Corps and their bloated administrative crap. <laughs> Probably need a car just to use the bathroom. Okay. No, it does not sound like a good idea. Locked. I wonder though. Nikki really didn't want her mom to know about this pass key she gave me. No way is some kid's card gonna bypass the next. We're in. You're kidding. What? Oh, Matt, yes. I didn't even need the password. Guys, we're in. <laughs> Matt. Go to the criminal records, Quill. I want to see my files. Twenty units, mine's the biggest. Blood it can't be that me. scary if they share a record. What <laughs> <laughs> brothers in custody? Twin rock lights. Known for war crimes that committed on behalf of an Austria in the Galactic War. Sentenced to 44 life sentences in the kiln. They escaped and joined the Lethal Legion. Yeah. Recently hired by Lady Hellbender. Currently held in custody with Cosmo. I've heard of this guy. He's part of a private army called the Lethal Legion. <laughs> More okay, like the Captain Loser Boy. Legion. This is a solicitation. The leader of the Lethal Legion terrorist organization. Sorry, guys, I'm going to be reading through all these because you know I'm a massive Marvel nerd, so this should be fun. What is it with you, Ooh, Humies, and your stupid Dark Hawk. names? Yo, whoa, whoa, whoa. Star Lord is not the same <laughs> league as Dark Hawk. Okay, mm. one's the name of the greatest band of all time, and the other's a bird. Mad. Yeah, he stole the uh, one of the Raptor crystals from the Shi'ar, I believe, and turned himself into a Dark Hawk. Mad, enhance human member of the Shi'ar Empire's banished fraternity of Raptors. Ooh, appears the fraternity of Raptors are responsible for several assassinations in the Shi'ar Empire. So that would imply um, War of Kings, with Lelandra being assassinated by the Dark Hawks, if I recall. Mad. So Drax's criminal record is pretty big. That is what your mother said. <laughs> it's great because <laughs> his mother's dead. Oh my god! <laughs> Fuck's sake. 
Galactic War Hero. Um, his defeat of the Mad Titan. You're on a murderous rampage. Quest the galaxy. Oh. Hmm. And they self surrender after helping the war. Reduce Drax's 100 year sentence for mass murder and various other charges in the maximum security. In the kiln, as after seven years served, he was released without bias. Oh, well. Join the gardeners of the galaxy. I thought there'd be more here. Barely scratches the surface. Then who bury? Yeah. Oh, ben Titan is the bit afterwards. Interesting. Former pet assassin. Oh, well. Under advice from Richard Ryder, amnesty has been granted. Cool. You? <laughs> A gold dome? Over my dead body, buddy. I was in Planet X. Last recorded member of the Floral Colossi of Planet X. Frequently seen in the company of Subject A89, E13. Rehabilitated with fairly much of 0.43. Determined Groot to be a yeah, potential candidate of Nova Corps, hence why I said Gold Dome. Stolen property. Submitted by Tanana to ban. <laughs> Theft of a floral colossus. Oh, uh, class. You know, for a non-spacefaring species, us humans sure get around. Whoa. Unfortunately. Whoa. Drax is a earthly daughter, because he was a human, turned into Drax by Thanatos, I believe, which was Thanos' grandfather, to hunt down Thanos and kill him. So that's his daughter, who was then raised by monks and uh, taps into her latent telepathic abilities Ooh, to become a moon dragon. That's so sick. Powerful telepathic planet Earth. I believe the entity known as the Dragon of the Moon has exerted influence over Douglas, corrupting her mental powers. Priority one flag. This was one of the three candidates prophesied by the priests of Pama to take the mantle of Celestial Madonna. Wow, that's what they called uh, Mantis earlier. Unknown. Well, she got in the galaxy at one point. Hey. Isn't that the guy we saw when we tried to pay our fine? Yeah, that's him. Jack Black, threat level village, a oh, galactic, unknown galactic, planetary, 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 continental. I am unfamiliar with this Kree. One of the nameless. Oh, spooky. Zach Dell. Diamond's vigilantism. Okay, Wraith. We have bonded with the Exelon. The bond has granted him certain enhanced abilities. An Exelon symbiote. It's not going to be like a symbiote symbiote, is it? Is that the name of the symbiote race, Exelons? I should really know that. This isn't in apprehending him. Blimey. This is written like the, in the Annihilation books, uh, the graphic novels, they had some pages were just information pages on certain characters that were popping up. It's very, very similar to that, which is cool. So, Jack Flag, Enhanced Human. Oh, the hide formula. Right. Look. Hmm. It's Jax's girlfriend. <laughs> the Hellbender is not my girlfriend. Yet. <laughs> Damn. Mine's a non member. Political status grants her certain immunities. Operates as sanctuary for monstrous creatures. Hmm. She's hired the Lethal Legion. Isn't this your friend from the bar? <laughs> Threat level yep. village. The Ride Doxlian, known as Lipless, a well known smuggler from. Notorious picture of Ruby Thursday. 
Grand Unifier Raker. Wonder what he was looking for in the quarantine. Bet love a mom. Probably hmm. nothing good. The now defunct Universal Church of Truth. A little known cult that rose to prominence in the Galactic War. They figurehead a supposed golden god with miraculous healing abilities. Hmm. Since his death, the cult has fallen into obscurity. It does sound like they took a lot of cues from, uh, and I'll say a lot from Annihilation. And uh, kind of War of, War of Kings as well. Potentially even Thanos Imperative with uh, a rift and things. Okay. Read it and weep, losers. There ain't a single scam me and Groot haven't pulled off. You <laughs> name it, we've done it. If you're charged, it means you've been caught. You realize that, right? Your point? <laughs> Extreme caution. A sweep of hidden explosives and traps is also prudent. Wow. When Kree cops go bad, they really go bad. Actually, an accuser is the equivalent of a judge, jury, and executioner. That's right. So he's gone rogue already. Aristocracy and former Supreme Accuser. He attempted to incite civil war on Kree law against the Supreme Intelligence. His efforts were thwarted in his title strip. So, yeah, this does take a lot of keys from some of the big comic stories in. But he retains an administrative position in the Kree Public Accuser Corps. Behind several corruption scandals in the Kree judicial government bodies. Wow, your record's a lot bigger than I expected. <laughs> How big were you expecting? Minuscule. <laughs> Human Spartoi hybrid. Former crown prince of the Spartoi Empire. Cool. Contributions to the resistance as we join the Battle of Mercury in the Sol system. Wow, so I got even close to got that close to Earth. But the Avengers still didn't know about it. Very interesting. Very interesting. Agreed to testify against Yondu or Dante. And the Ravager Space Pirates. Regarding the involvement in the kidnapping of the child known as Idea of Sacred Heart. Don't know that. Which is a new business. Intention and legitimacy of the enterprise, which bears no relation to botany, <laughs> remains GPS. Another guy from Earth. Oh shit! I'm telling you, Quill, C53 is the trailer park of the galaxy. No fucking way! <laughs> no way have they got one to warn my god quasar oh that's sick the fact that they've got all these kind of like at least rendered suggests that they could potentially i guess appear in oh man in future guns against games they get more which i really hope they do holy shit reckless flying noise compared to swordly conduct mate it's one of the best cosmic heroes out there okay enhanced human augmented with the quantum bands yeah 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 absolutely created by anything known as eon these are the bands near population so this has resulted in the generation of this file. An important asset to the resistance during the Galactic War, as expected. A prime candidate for the Nova Corps. The recruitment package has been dispatched to its last location. Affiliation Shield, Project Pegasus, and the resistance. Fun fact! That bounty on you put out is how me and Groot met Quill. <laughs> I'm just glad I talked you out of collecting it. <laughs> Who says you did? <laughs> Formerly to the Ravages. Attempts and failed to escape five times. <laughs> and still during the Galactic War, Jesus. And there's that down. That's awesome. All right, let's take a look. Wow, super riveting, Quill. <laughs> and to think we could still be reading my criminal record. Please do not. I was wondering how they knew about us. Quill must have tripped the sensors on the way out. Isn't that the mining rig from the quarantine zone? Oh, great. Looks like your girlfriend was collecting evidence against us even after the two of you struck a deal. <laughs> I still do not understand how the Churchman's ship exploded. The Nova Corps is known for their security protocols. It's called stupidity, Drax. Something the bucket has got a lot of. <laughs> It's a list of bucket heads. <laughs> uh, we already know your girlfriend works here, Quill. So, it might have useful info or something. 
Instrumental in rebuilding efforts across the galaxy. Request a permanent assignment to the quarantine zone. Interesting. Agent of Thanos? Gamora, Ooh. care to explain? Not really. Except that it wasn't me. She... Shia? Oh yeah, Chandela. Recruiter Roman Day. Oh, mad! Centurion Roman Day. Sick. Accomplished diplomat assigned to Chandela. The throne world. Wait, is Malik Tarsa the one who went against... Lelandra? Oh, you, oh, okay. He's able to broker a tenuous alliance with Majestic Lelandra. We saw an opportunity to expand her empire shortly after an agent of Thanos attempted to assassinate them both. Tarsa did not survive. Afterward, Majestic rejected the alliance. Check it out. Nikki's got a file. <laughs> Boring. <laughs> Origin redacted, huh? Her father remains unknown. <laughs> I have heard of this one. Mm -hmm. He's a good man. Except good means scut when you're dead. I don't know we're alive. Mad. Top of his class from Nova Academy. Prime Commandant Day ever saw the day separation of New Nova Corps Space Militia. Hmm. Create a blockade against Chitauri forces. Which is instrumental in the evacuation of Xandar. Okay. Only one squadron would survive. Blimey. MIA and presumed dead. Hey, Wall. Oh. Then who is running Nova Corps? That's a good question. Rank Prime. He's Nova Prime, you know. That's sick. Okay. Absent without leave. Okay, Nova Prime, the former acting leader of Nova Corps, selected by the World Mind after his squadron was the only one to survive the destruction of Xandar. I still think that's how we'll see him introduced in the MCU. Leadership during the Galactic War. Several victories, the final seed of Shitari Prime. Post war rider took a more political role. Rebuilding the Nova Corps militia. Absent without leave for multiple rotations, lost all contact with him. Hmm. Be great to see him. On she this. crashed into a Leviathan on purpose and is still a better pilot than Quill. <laughs> hey, what? You know it's true. Fuck's sake. Oh, Samaya, she was in. Holy shit. She was in Annihilation as well. She flew through with uh, Richard Ryder to escape Xandar from the Annihilation wave. Oh, she was a Denarian. Okay. That, that's a rank, not race. But she's the same race as um, Yonder, I'm pretty sure. Mad. That's awesome. Okay, uh, audio logs. Get to the juicy stuff already. Channeling your Nova Force. A, a comprehensive, comprehensive guide to meditation and managing your mental health. Actually, I wouldn't mind a copy of that. Pass. <laughs> Let me get this straight. She became a teapot? That's what my source said. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. I hate you all. <laughs> well, that uh, don't sound good. Okay. The audio file must be corrupted. The audio okay. file and everything else in the galaxy. Attention away team. Please ensure your helmet cams are in full operation ahead of this afternoon's away mission into the quarantine zone. Thank you. Just like Corel, everything by the book. Yeah. Okay, this is where it's gonna get interesting, guys. Gotta be something in here. Oh, nice. Hey, wasn't that the mining ship we explored in the quarantine zone? Yeah. When's the footage from? Signal stronger. We must be close. That's where they found the infinity Hard to say. There's too much interference. Centurion Corral! Found something. After we left, oh, Flark. 
That thing... You don't think. It is the creature that devoured our monster. <laughs> Could have been a million things. I mean, it's restricted space for a reason. <laughs> no, you're a Lotus Scut. That thing's got nothing to do with us. That gem Corral picked up. I think it's the same one we shot in the quarantine zone. Uh, we? You're the one who shot it. Fine, the gem I shot. The point is, is that shadow thing came out of it. We did this. The quarantine zone's a giant death trap. So we released a shadow thing. We made it out, didn't we? Your stupid girlfriend probably did too. You've been saying the whole time she's probably dead. <laughs> yeah, probably alive, probably dead, whatever. Important thing is, we're all fine. Corel is tough. If anyone made it out, it's her. I know it. Anything in this one? No? Okay. Uh no, it's just Riker. Guardians of the galaxy. You misread our intentions. No, you've made them pretty clear. Sometimes sacrifices <laughs> must Mad. I had the check. <laughs> yes, Root, Rocket. Write the stars. Grand Unifier, Breaker, right? First, let me just say it's really cool that you've heard of us, right, <laughs> guys? And it's cool that you didn't try to kill us just then, especially with your two pals right there. You could have totally ripped us apart the moment you walked in, which we obviously all appreciate. But also, we've kind of got a few questions, like... Where are Centurion Corel and her daughter? You came here seeking truth. Rejoice. The matriarch wishes to share it with you. Sathian warriors often ride into battle completely naked. Keep your pants on. Although it could be used as a distraction. Yeah, no. Any other ideas? Can you froth? I can froth. Can you twitch? Yeah, I'm pretty twitchy. All right. On my cue, you drop, froth, and twitch. While they're all distracted, we take off down one of them side halls. What about me? You, well, you know, you, uh, take one for the team. <laughs> I'm not gonna- Walk with me! Matt. Come on, Quill, just grab your chest and drop. Find another plan. See, I don't know if Adam Warlock's gonna be a good guy or bad guy. I thought it was the Magus that- So, this the Matriarch asked for us by evil. name? You, specifically. Although I cannot fathom why. Peter's constantly surprising us, too. But if he's first in line for brainwashing, I gotta say- Is that what you think? That we're brainwashing people? We've met your recent converts. Overly zealous doesn't even begin to describe They them. have embraced the Matriarch's promise. A life-altering experience, yes. But one that must be freely accepted. Quill, his drone. 
That's her ticket out of here. What? How? What are you two whispering about? Well? He wants to know if you know you're the bad guy. Actually, we were just admiring how <laughs> huge this place is. It is grand, isn't it? Belief in the Matriarch restored it to what it was before the war. Just as her promise will restore everyone we lost. Mothers. Lovers. Sons. This promise will raise the dead? Of course it won't. We can't bring people back. We can't. But the Matriarch, the divine vessel, I got an idea, but I need time. Stall him! What? <laughs> Come. Join me! I mean, can't really if say no. I intended to kill you. That point, I guess. Wow. Oh, oh, okay. That. Uh, that is a cool trick. We'll explain how you did it. Sorcery. I can understand <laughs> how some might see it that way, but I used science. The science of faith. Faith is not science. But faith energy is. This skiff, my inquisitors, even Sacrosanct herself, all powered by the same miraculous energy. Energy I discovered. I'm going for the drone. Keep him talking. What now? What? What is it? It's just, um. You, uh. You uh, discovered stuff, and you claim to uh, control energy. Faith energy. <laughs> right. Uh, well, it just seems like all this uh, faith energy is is. Uh, I, I think what Gamora's point is is, um, you say you have all of this energy. Faith energy. Right, but when we first saw you. Weren't you stranded on Hallow's Hope because your shuttle ran out of juice? Yes, I was, but... <laughs> so why didn't you just believe that your ship had more gas? It doesn't work that way. Faith energy is a byproduct of belief. Focused belief. <laughs> okay, sure. I saw this proven. Focused belief in him is what enabled us to survive. So, you were saying... Wait. Weren't there more of you? What? No, no, no. <laughs> no, no. Nope. It seems like the kind of thing that we would be aware of. Indeed. Please, continue your fascinating account of... Uh, you were saying something about him? It seems super important. <laughs> right, right, uh, your father. Uncle. Son? My son died of disease. The him I was referring to was someone else. The first divine vessel of this church, before it was even a church. An absurd faith healer, bathed in golden light and wielding unfathomable power. He saw my loss, our collective loss, knew its cause, but refused to reverse it. Because he, personally, never felt what we feel. That is why I founded this church. To heal. To give hope to those who have lost everything. <coughs> Wait. There were more of you. The little one is missing. Perhaps he died like your son. <laughs> <laughs> what? Right? Yes. Good point, Groot. 
He is totally into his spiritual mission. But I think I figured out all of this. Those were some pretty sweet holograms. I think even the world might have been jealous. I mean, they must have cost you an arm and a... Well, another arm. <laughs> right? And this? That's a pretty sweet trick to you, but everybody's got anti grab these days. Oh, and let me guess. You got your own personal shield generator tucked under that terror toad, don't you? <laughs> a little makeup, some color coordination. Oh, loving the gold laser light show, by the way. And little scan. <laughs> I'm actually impressed. Well, good for you. Hey, I get it, man. You gotta sell the brand before you stage the miracle. <laughs> oh, man, this one time on Rigel 3... You I think you're all very good. You hope to delay me because you're afraid. But there is nothing to fear. Why... Get back here where I can see you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's time <laughs> to meet the matriarch. Okay, so we've, we've got that in the back pocket. <laughs> Hopefully. Rocket, tell me you have an escape plan. We're gonna summon the Milan. My new buddy will show us the way. We're being very cryptic, Rodent. Yeah, well, we'll get twitchy when I'm surrounded by giant murder bots. They just want us to meet their new mommy. Speaking of which. Who else thinks Will's ex-girlfriend traded in her cop badge for cult ropes? Come <laughs> on. What? I'm just saying what we're all thinking. This game is incredible. Okay, here's this matriarch out now. Someone new, someone I know. Oh. Hmm. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God, it's not Nicky, is it? Attacking blood. My lady, as requested, the guardians of the galaxy. Thank you, Grand Unifier. Did not see this coming. Guardians, you may approach. Holy shit. Peter Quill, order your offspring to come down from there this instant. <laughs> Maybe I'm out of line, but aren't you a little young for a dress that short? Aren't you a little old to write your name on your clothes? <laughs> Took you long enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, you know, chatty grandpa gets. <laughs> hey, we're gonna get you out of here. Just follow my lead. But. This is where we're supposed to be. Oh. We're gonna save everybody. I'm gonna save them, I promised. Come on, snap out of it, kid. You're just saying what he wants you to say. Oh, hold on, everybody! The just... girl is clearly not herself. Of course I am. But I'm more than just me. Oh. <laughs> what do you mean? Where's your mom? Mom is here. She's right here. Inside me. Oh, thanks for clearing that up. <laughs> the light joined us. I thought she was gone. But I can bring her back. They're all waiting for us to bring them back. All we need is faith. The Grand Unifier helped me understand. This is one big con. Trust me, I know a thing or two about- Why can't you just believe in me? Why won't you just listen? Nobody ever listens. Until I show them. Stop, 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 
She doesn't have to die, Peter. You can save her. I promise. Mad. You saved me! That's how! I knew you would never leave me! I, I, I didn't, I mean... Look at you! Look at you, all grown up! And into the great leader I knew you would become! <laughs> Peter, I am so proud of you. Your father would be so proud. I, I, I don't understand. I, I saw you die. Am I... Can I go back? You are here. That's all that matters. We have all the time in the world now. You and me, and your friends, too. My friends? Sure. The house is plenty big enough. And I want to meet this amazing team of yours and hear all about your incredible adventures. <laughs> <laughs> that is... You don't know how bad I've wanted this. Oh, nothing will ever break us apart, I promise, Peter. I promise. I can't believe I have you back. Uh, Mom, you're squeezing kind of tight. We have so much time to make up for. Maybe we'll finally get to finish that game. Can you feel it? The promise is all around us. The matriarch will reunite us now and forever. Plugs are like new, so that's not the problem. I guess that needs replacing. That was a little loose. Shouldn't be the cause of the problem, though. Hmm. Might need to top off the oil. Peter! Dinner's almost ready! Yeah, be right there, Mom! Meredith Quill, where do you keep your carving knives? Oh my gosh. Oh, there's one in the drawer, nearest the stove. All I see is a dull instrument fit for a child. <laughs> That's the one. I will have to bring you a Katathian blade on our next visit. They can slice through solid steel. That's very generous, Drax. I just don't know how often I'll be chopping through something that hard. <laughs> Watching baseball. I can also supply a few recipes. My wife makes a delicious axe head soup. That sounds hearty. It actually tastes a lot better than it sounds. Our fiercest warriors oh God, swear it by it. Well, in that case, how can I resist? On the screen. There you are, Peter. I was just about to come out and call you again. Some things never change, I suppose. Ah, Peter Quill. Your mother was just telling us about your childhood. Just some of your better adventures? She also told us she had found a suitable mate for you, but you refused to see reason. Drax, you said that would stay between us. We've only been on Earth for half a day, Mom, and you're already playing matchmaker? I've waited this long for grandkids, Peter. Haven't you told her about Nikki, Peter? Nikki? Who's she? She is Peter Quill's illegitimate daughter. Your illegitimate granddaughter. Uh, I was trying to find the right time to tell you? Sounds like we need to have a serious talk over dinner, Peter. 
Why do I feel like I'm about to get ground? Can't believe you still have this. The craftsmanship is shoddy at best. <laughs> Be nice, Strax. Peter tried. Oh, that's great. The shit mad that is you don't know how bad I've wanted this oh nothing will ever break us apart I promise Peter I promise I can't let go of me stop I can't believe I have you back oh, I didn't realize I could move uh, mom you're squeezing kind of tight Jeremy. seriously mom Stop hugging me! Peter! It's okay, it's me! Peter! What are you doing? Oh god, I'm sorry. This isn't funny. Put that down, young man. Oh god. I told you to put it down! <sighs> I don't understand. Of course it's me. This isn't right. <clears throat> Please. You have to trust me. I can't. This isn't real. No. Don't give up on me. I am not going anywhere. Peter, please. We can be together. Now, Peter, while it's distracted, we can reach 